About 40,000 farmers in Borno State, whose agricultural livelihoods have been disrupted by the insurgency, are to benefit from a free rainy season intervention by the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations. But well, this, according to the organization, would help mitigate the looming food insecurity in the region. TVC News' Jesse Tafida reports. In northeastern Nigeria, the Boko Haram insurgency has disrupted farming activities for over a decade. A research conducted by the Food and Agriculture Organization in October 2019 indicates that about 2.7 million people in Borno, Yobe and Adamawa state are facing critical food insecurity due to the insurgency. Now, the organization with support from government of Canada, Germany, the European Union Trust Fund for Africa, European Civil Protection and Humanitarian Aid Operations, the Kingdom of Norway and Sweden are stepping up to change the narrative. Today, the FAO and the Borno State Ministry of Agriculture are here to distribute farming input to vulnerable farmers. This is the sixth successive rainy season farming intervention the organization has so far implemented in the region. This intervention also are designed to address the need of the most vulnerable population in the Bay State by building their skills and providing them with the required input for economic sufficiency. Through the FAO Farmer Field School approach, the beneficiary of this intervention will have access to community-based and hands-on extension services. The Bernosti government appreciates the gesture and believes this will go a long way in boosting the food security in the state. But no state government is not unaware of the numerous contributions of FAO. FAO's efforts in these local governments are well appreciated by the government and people of Borno State. One after another, the farmers received their share of farming inputs. She says we are grateful for the organization and the government of Borno State for this gesture. We haven't experienced such for a long time, and we are hopeful that this would boost our harvest this year. With this intervention, farmers are hopeful that the harvest of this year will be more bountiful than 2020. Jesse Tafida, TVC News, Maituguri.